baby, don't check for me. Taking time out to be and live my life off screen. Taking time out. To hey guys, it's Sharika. Welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe before you leave. Today is Tuesday and I'm on my way to the gym. I'm going to have a pretty busy day today. Once I leave the gym, I have some errands to run. My parents are actually having Thanksgiving tomorrow, which is Thanksgiving Eve. So, of course, I'm on macaroni and cheese duty. So, I have to go to the store to get that stuff. Plus, the stuff for my own Thanksgiving dinner. I have to run to the post office. I have to get a pedicure. Um, What else? I think that's pretty much it for today. So I'm going to hit up the gym really quick and then I'll see you guys in the car. All right, y'all. So I am done at the gym. I had a pretty good workout. It was leg day today. So one of the machines that I usually use, the machine was broken. But there's a different machine that you can load the free weights on and it's the exact same movements. But y'all know I don't like to go over there. So I couldn't do that. But I did buy a kettlebell. I know y'all don't care about this. But I bought a kettlebell, 45 pound kettlebell. So I can do, I haven't used it yet. My son's been using it. But I could try to do um, some squats and stuff. I wanna try to incorporate that in my leg workout do some deadlifts and some squats with that kettlebell so we're gonna try that when we get home y'all won't be a part of that though i'm gonna be on the struggle bus by myself so right now i'm gonna go to the post office and then trader joe's and then once i drop the groceries off then um, i'm gonna go get a pedicure get my toes red. I actually had an appointment on the 18th at the same location that I went the last time I got my pedicure done with the same woman because she was really good. She had me really relaxed. Girl, I was stressed and depressed. No, I wasn't depressed. I ain't gonna play that word. Um, but yeah, she just relaxed me and I really enjoyed that pedicure and I missed the appointment. <laughs> Girl. So I'm going to try to go to that one guy that I told y'all about. I haven't been up there in a while. And the last few times that I went in there to see if he could do my pedicure, he had someone in his chair and some people was waiting on him. I'm telling y'all, he is so good. The only thing about him is he doesn't speak very good English. And I don't like that, but I like the way he makes me feel. So I'm going to stick my head in there and see if he could do this. So like I said, right now I'm headed to the post office, Trader Joe's to get Thanksgiving dinner, all the stuff that I need because I'm on macaroni and cheese duty for Thanksgiving tomorrow at my parents' house. So let's go. So it is raining a little bit, but since I'm over here, I said, well, I might as well just pop my head at Home Goods, see what they have really quick. This is one of my favorite locations, but lately they really haven't had anything. But I'm gonna go in. If I can find a good parking spot, I think it's one right here in the front if this lady get out. Yep, I got one right in the front. It's a little tight. I might bump the curb. Let's see. Mm -hmm. All right. Let me put my keys in my little bag. And then, oh, let me straighten on my head a little bit. And then we're going to go in here. And then after we leave here, we're going to Trader Joe's. Maybe Target because they're like right next door. <laughs> I don't need to go on Target. I've been going on Target all week. I'm trying to decide what 
type of meat I want to do. I like turkey. I actually really enjoy white meat, but my little family, they don't really care for turkey. So I might do like a stuffed chicken or stuffed rotisserie chicken. I don't really know just yet what we're gonna do, but I'm gonna think about it while I'm out. It's an ugly day, but I don't mind it. Oh my God, I think I might get this. I've been wanting like a bigger one like this. I think I might get this. I wish it was black, but it'll do because I've been looking for it. During the holiday times, it's the best time to come look for all of your like designer table books because they always have them out. Like they have the Ralph Lauren one. a little candy dish. I didn't stop to get my pedicure just yet because I had to come home to get some stuff done. But I did want to show you guys what I picked up from Home Good. So I have a video that I haven't put out yet as of today, which is Tuesday, but it's, it's ready to go. It's been just waiting on them to approve the remainder of my vlog. The sponsored content portion has been approved already, but they want to look at the full video and it still hasn't been approved yet. So we're just waiting. But I did tell y'all that I was looking for something to use as a candy stand. So I found this. I know y'all like, uh, what is that? <laughs> so let me just find the bottom part to it. Put it in. Okay. So I have like a cute little small two tier candy tray that I used last year, but it's silver, so I wanted something that was gold. So I found this and I thought that this would be perfect to just sit on my table up front with my cute little gold wrapped candy. So this was cool. And this is probably like a little treat dish. If you have like um, parties, you can 
put your little refreshments on here, whatever. You can set your candle on here, whatever you want to do. I would say this is like an all-purpose stand. I'm going to use it for a few different things, but for right now, it's going to be used as a candy tray. It's handcrafted in India, and this one was $14.99. So I love that. And then I picked up this petrified wood because I've been wanting like a bigger slab like this. I wish it was black and white like the one that I have up front and just this size because when I first got my petrified wood, I have like two different ones. I would always pass up the bigger ones and I regretted it later because they just look so cute sitting out on your table or your countertops and I like to put my candles on it. Um, the other one is what I use for my candles on my dining room table or my living room table. But I wanted a bigger one and now I can't find the big flat black and white ones. Well it's like black and cream marble type petrified wood is so pretty but I like this one too I have a brown one like this already but it's small so I was really happy to have this one and like I said I just sit it up on my countertop and put my candles on it so I love this this was $49.99 so I grabbed that what else Oh, I had to grab some more of my vanilla bean syrup. I love this stuff. And then, oh, this is the last thing that I picked up. You guys know that I have a new Christmas scent. Y'all know before it was the apple pumpkin candles. I put everybody on on those candles and I switched my favorite candle out to Winter Pine by Santa Fall. That's now my new favorite scent for this time of the year, Winter Pine, but I couldn't find any Winter Pine, but they did have the Winter White by Santa Fall. It looks like this. And it basically smells the same. It basically smells the exact same. So winter pine, love, 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 or winter white smells really good. When y'all get a chance, go smell it and let me know what you think. It's very Christmassy. It puts you in the holiday spirit. And I love this one. Now, if you could get the winter pine, I would recommend that one. I do have... I think like one left. I'm burning one up front right now. And I think that's my last one. But like I said, this one smells very similar to the Winter Pine. So I love this one. These were $7.99. I got two of these. And then if you guys know, you know I am a teakwood girl. So I bought the teakwood and oak, and this is the vegan soy wax blend. Looks like this. So I like pretty much any type of teakwood. It's my favorite scent, I think, overall teakwood. I like masculine candle scents. This one smells really nice, so I grabbed that. Everything else is groceries for Thanksgiving. So I got some stuff that I'm making for Thanksgiving. My stuff that I'm making for macaroni and cheese tomorrow for my parents' house. And that is pretty much it. So I'm going to go ahead and put the stuff up. And I'll show you. Well, hopefully that video is approved today because it's just stopping me from filming up front because I don't want y'all I did the big reveal of the Christmas tree in the last vlog so if I take y'all up front and show y'all how the candy tray looks then y'all might see something that y'all don't need to be seen and I want to wait okay because I need the big reveal I didn't even put it on Instagram yet because 
I want y'all to see it first. Although it's been burning me inside. Because I want, I already have my reel ready for Instagram. And I want to do it so bad. Because it's just so beautiful. It turned out really nice. I'm very happy with it. Um, and in that video, I didn't have my topper done. But the topper's done now. So once that video goes out, then you guys will see. I'll do another video showing you guys how the topper looks and things like that. So yeah, let me go ahead and put this stuff up and get me something to eat because I am starving. So let me put y'all on real quick. I just made this on my other channel. Ever since I had this for brunch at RH, I've been like addicted to it. If you guys follow me on Instagram, I've posted it like three or four times because I make it all the time. Let me turn on my light so y'all can see this goodness. Okay, so I like to do mine with cream cheese. I use a certain type of cream cheese. Sprouts, smoked salmon, and avocado, and then a little bit of honey. It's so bomb. But I tried new smoked salmon today. This one is from Trader Joe's. It's hot smoked. It's seasoned with cracked peppercorn, mustard seeds, and lemon. Look at this. Y'all, it's so good. It's a little pricey. But it's worth it y'all it's delicious so if you guys like stuff like this you get smoked salmon you know in these little thin packs like this you can usually find it like in the seafood department at your local grocery store um but like i said this one is from trader joe's i've never seen this like at a publix or sprouts or anything like that so again it's the smoked wild smoked sockeye salmon and then it's the one that is seasoned with the cracked peppercorn mustard seeds and lemon. Look how seasoned this is. Y'all, it's so good. And y'all know like the regular smoked salmon, it kind of still looks on the raw side. But this one is cooked to perfection, I'm telling y'all. It is so good. Like, I love it. The one at RH, the, the I don't know what this is called. Um, the smoked salmon at RH for the brunch, it comes on sourdough bread, which is my favorite. But I've been doing mine on bagels and I'm hooked, y'all. Like, I love it. It's so, so good. These are the bagels that I'm using today. But you can use any type of bagels. But I like a nice, soft, chewy bagel. So this is the one that I picked up. And y'all, it's just, it's so good. I went to Old Navy and I picked up some more pajamas. Now y'all know the last pair was the black Santa Claus from Target for me and my little sister. I bought some more for my husband, my son, and myself. I bought shorts for me. How cute. And then I bought the pajama pants for them. The original price is $24.99 but they're on sale for nine dollars if you go online you can get them for eight dollars i don't know how long that's gonna last but that was the deal for today so great deal see this is the original price but like i said i got these for nine bucks and i did link them for somebody on instagram and they were eight bucks online so i think they did say that that sale was only good for today so love these i thought these were so cute also had the thermal style you know where it's tighter at the bottom they had that style which i thought was really cute for a girl of course um but i wanted to you know match my boys so i got the shorts they fit so cute and then i got socks with mine oh my God. <laughs> how cute come on now how cute i'm racking up on the pajamas okay because this christmas is just gonna be magical but this is just adorable adorable i love it and my package from target is here so let me open this so you guys can see what it is okay y'all so so i got the 12 days of self-care advent calendar from target i actually saw this one on tiktok 
they were sold out in stores and I found it online. So I'm so excited. So I bought one for my sister and one for myself. And I can't wait to open them. So yes, it has like masks, different kind of mask in here, vitamins, toner, just all of the things. Let me show y'all. I'm so excited. This is gonna be fun. Y'all know me and my little sister. We love having sister time, so <laughs> I got something cute for us to do. I forgot to show y'all something else. On the last five days of Christmas, we take turns hosting something at our house um, for the family. We just do family games, whatever. You have to come up with your own thing. So um, yesterday, I bought some games for us to play. So I bought Twister. Um, this is Jingle Bell Pong. So this is how it looks. So it's two players. I've never played this before, but I know it's gonna be a lot of fun. And is this the one? I thought I got four games. The name of this game is called For the Girls. It's a, an adult party game. So it's like this, so it's just different questions. <laughs> so this should be fun. Um, even though my brother them should be in town, but it's mostly girls. So we're gonna have a ball. Um, and then we bought some of these little karaoke microphones. So we got two of those. So we got the black one and the gold one to do karaoke. We tried to charge it up a little bit yesterday to play with it. Let me let y'all hear. I don't know, Khalil was trying to, hello? This one I don't think it's, I don't even know how to turn this thing on. It might be dead. Let me try this one. Cause I know she charged them a little bit yesterday. Oh yeah, it's complete. Let me see. Yes, yeah, completely dead. But the this part right here lights up, and then you can hear yourself through the speaker, and you connect it to your Bluetooth. So we're gonna have a real good time. Okay. This one's prettier than this one. We found these at Marshalls yesterday for sixteen ninety nine each. And then y'all know holiday time, they have all the cool little games and stuff out. So. The game for the girls, this one was only $12.99. This one is gonna be a lot of fun. And then the Jingle Pong, Jingle Pong, well, Jingle Bell Pong was $7.99. And then Twister was only $14.99. So that's exciting. We're gonna have such a good time. I'm so excited about the Christmas content gonna be a lot of fun so I might not when we when we you know ex when we um have it at someone else's house I'm not too sure if I'll vlog just because everybody don't like being on YouTube and I try to respect everybody's privacy and sometimes you just want to be in the moment and have a good time um but when we're here oh I'm gonna turn up okay <laughs> <laughs> so I know one thing with me not being able to post that video that I had for y'all today I'm mad about that I need to email them and tell them look it's upsetting me and my homegirls that we can't see this Christmas tree <laughs> gotta edit this video and get it out to y'all today and then that one I'll probably get out to you guys either Friday or Sunday. So that's the plan. Maybe y'all will see the Christmas tree before then if y'all following me on Instagram and on TikTok. Maybe you'll get some of that content. I'm thinking about maybe going live 
and making a dish with y'all maybe i'm not too sure it just really depends on how i feel if i'm gonna try to start early and then that way i'm not rushing my plan was to prep the food here and put it in the oven at my parents house so that's what my plan was originally but um i know ryan and my mama will be doing most of the cooking and then I think everybody's bringing a dish, but for the biggest things, I'm pretty sure Rain and my mama will be making it like the dressing. My mama have to make the dressing. The greens, if she decided to make beans, whatever type of meat, they might do pot rolls or something like that. I'm not too sure. I didn't even ask. I just know I'm going over there to eat and have me a good time. I bought another bottle of the detox, so I'm ready. <laughs> Low vibrational plates. Give them to me, okay? I'm not gonna go crazy, but it's my birthday weekend. I'm gonna have a good time. I wanna enjoy my food, enjoy my family. So I wanna tell you guys, happy Thanksgiving. I love all of y'all so, so much. And like I said, I'll try to go live tomorrow and maybe let you guys watch me make the macaroni and cheese or maybe Thursday morning I'll go live, which will be Thanksgiving. And, you know, let y'all talk to me while I'm doing my food prep, getting my dinner ready. So we'll figure out something, but you guys will see my face either tomorrow or on Thanksgiving. So that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram at I am Sharika B and TikTok Sharika B too. And I'll see you guys on the next one. I'll holler.